Really wish I had my drone, DJI. Hint, hint. Hey everyone, this week I'm going to Palos Verdes on a trail called the Shipwreck Trail. And I want to touch on the subject of shipwrecked lives. So let's go. So here we are at the Palos Verde Shipwreck Trail. I'm super excited to see what's in store. It's kind of hidden, you can't even see, but it's right there. Kind of hidden, but uh, still pretty cool. And I guess, I guess that can symbolize the hidden struggles in our life that keep us shipwreck. The things that we overlook, the things that we don't acknowledge, keeps us shipwreck. So let's see if this is a trail or if it's just the wrong location on the map. It looks pretty cool, that's for sure. Okay, honestly, it doesn't actually look like a trail, but I'm just gonna see where it goes. I'm, I think this is it still. I guess this can symbolize, you know, the struggles in our life we have to overcome. It's not always clear paths that lay before us. Sometimes they're rocky. So this trail is about three miles of walking on loose rocks. Maybe sometimes we have to walk through the struggle in order to see what our shipwreck really is. So right about now I guess you guys are asking, what is a shipwreck life? And I guess it's, it's different for everybody. For some people, it's maybe small struggles that, that they continually avoid. And those small struggles, in time, well, they become big struggles. But if those things are not taken care of, those are the very things that can wreck a ship. But if you live in darkness, how do you know when your ship is about to wreck? Okay, so let's say this ship is you, sailing through the open sea of life, problem free. But what happens when the dark storm comes and you are hit with waves of trouble, heartache, and intense struggle? Without clarity, we are dangerously close to smashing into the rocky cliffs. What we need is a lighthouse. And so what is the lighthouse? It's Christ. But I think many have avoided the light because the dark is so tantalizing. Now, how can I, a man who struggles so much, say this? It's because I am just as shipwrecked as everybody else. I am this disaster. I am a shipwreck. But it's not me that's in charge of fixing it. It is only Christ who can restore me and make me sail again. I know this is uh, super intense for some people maybe, but I have to be real with who I am and not let the shipwreck of my life go on any further.
And here's the end video. Yay, woohoo! All right, so down here, my face, subscribe. Please, click it, you'll see a subscribe button, push it. Up here, best of videos. Yeah, I made them, they're best. Okay, down here is what YouTube thinks you would like. Okay, let's see if they're right. And up here is my website. Check it out. All right, cool, cool, cool. Thanks, see you guys next week.